Good morning, church. Pastor Gary here, coming to you with this week's, uh, or today's, uh, Vital Merger Prayer. Uh, we're in week six. Uh, this is day three of week six, so we're on uh, day 38 in the, in the guide. And today is a day that's a little different. I'm going to pray a little differently than what's in here. Uh, because the author suggests that today is the day we deal, we pray about uh, properties, uh, physical church buildings. And, and he says that the buildings would sell in a timely manner. Now that, that may be a reality as three churches become one, but, but just uh, that's a hard leap for us to, many of us to make is that we were going to sell our church. Uh, and how do we do that and everything else? So, so today we're praying for the Lord's discernment, how that happens and, and when that happens and, and how to go about it and, and the, the ministries that would come into those buildings. Uh, Lord, we want to pray for that whole process uh, today. So, And I know this one is uh, very uncomfortable. Uh, so we're also going to pray that we is uh, who, who find that place to be our spiritual home for a long time uh, would, be, would be open to, to, to transitioning into a, a, a new place. And that we would want to celebrate what's happened there and look forward to what's going to happen there uh, with, some, with another group of people. And, and possibly uh, that we would be able to build something even more fantastic in a new place. So uh, the scripture that the author uses is from Ecclesiastes chapter 3, one that you're probably familiar with. For everything there is a season, a time for every activity under heaven, a time to tear down and a time to build up. So we're not tearing down, we're building up. So join me in praying today. God, we ask you to lead us, Lord. For all the moving parts when it comes to the, our church buildings, Lord, um, help us to help us to take part in that process, Lord. If it, if it is buildings are to be sold, Lord, then, then we ask for a quick sale for those properties, Lord, that that new owners would come in who are going to continue a vital ministry, God, an important ministry in those in those buildings that have held your people, been a place for your people to worship you for years and years. Lord, but we know that they're not going to last forever. We're, none of the, nothing does other than you and your love for us. So, God, do we just ask that, that as we transition, and as our transition includes buildings, buildings that mean a lot to us, Lord, you would just comfort us. That we'd be able to celebrate what's happened there over the years. And we'd be excited about what's going to happen in the years to come. Lord, we need you in this. Lead us. Guide us. And ultimately, Lord, use us for your glory. We love you. Amen. I know this isn't an easy one today. Uh, and you are certainly in my prayers. God bless you.